Hi, I'm Brita O'Connell of BOC Image Consulting. I always had a love for style and makeup. It was always something that was just innately there. I didn't even think about it. Kind of came to realise that it was working with one-to-one -one with women was what I wanted to do. You know, helping to just really understand what someone was coming to you with and giving them something to really take away from it. What I see very much with my clients is these women will have a backstory and they'll have had some experience that will have brought them to me and they're at this stage where they're now ready for change. They've given a lot of themselves to whatever it is that life has presented to them. It could be nursing a loved one who passed away. It could have gone through some an illness themselves like cancer. And so all these life changes impact how we see ourselves. And when a client comes to me, she's come through it and she's at the other side and now she's ready to reconnect with that part of her that has been lost through all of what she's been through. And she's ready to give herself that time again. There are different levels to the process, so I suppose the entry level, as I would call it myself, would be to get to grips with your body shape and your style personality. I think that's the starting point and that's the key foundation. And from that, you can start to build the elusive capsule wardrobe. With colour analysis, it's talking about the colours that are right for a client in terms of both her clothes and her makeup. So one is an extension of the other. So what's very key, I suppose, in makeup especially, is getting the undertone correct. So I trained as a makeup artist, but in all my training and all my experience, skin undertone was never something that was taught to me till I did colour analysis in terms of becoming an image consultant. Um, and it's the key mistake that I see clients making. They think that it's the foundation shade is wrong for them, but actually they've been advised to wear a warm toned foundation when they have a cool undertone. So it's just very, very small thing, but a very key thing. Um, so with colour analysis, you go through a process of what we call draping. Through looking at a client's physical characteristics, her hair, skin and eyes, you determine what we call her dominant characteristic. You talk about the three elements of colour. So that's the depth of colour, the hue of colour, whether it's warm or cool, and the clarity, whether it's very clear, bright, primary colour, or whether it's a more subdued, soft, muted colour. And these are the elements that are very crucial on how a person looks. It's by a process of comparison that a client will see what colours work and what colours don't work. And you very quickly determine when you see a colour that looks okay, the, cl the client might like it because they might be drawn to that colour, but then when you put the correct hue and level of clarity for them, it's quite transformative the effect it will have on them. And it's a great gift for a woman to give back to herself, to actually give herself that space and time um, and rediscover the joy that can be had with dressing because it becomes a chore when life takes over, it becomes a chore and something that women in our multitasking busy lives just don't have time for. But I just want to show a client that it's something that can be done, they just need the proper framework, the correct guidelines, and that's what I will give them. And I am passionate about really giving them practical tools. Um, you know, I don't just want to go through the motions and have them go away with knowing how to dress for an occasion. I want to give them something that will transform their lives and make it that bit easier every day. If this sounds like a good fit for you, and this sounds like something that would give you real clarity moving forward, I'd encourage you to book a discovery call and very quickly we can assess what the best course of action for you is.